Today we're reviewing the effects of blunt force trauma and some of the ways that solutions from Spartan Armor Systems and their body armor can help minimize and mitigate this effect. As the name suggests, blunt force trauma is damage resulting from the impact of a blunt object when it impacts soft tissue. The degree of blunt force trauma can vary widely and is relative to the amount of force absorbed. This means the resulting wound could be anything, ranging from light bruising all the way up to broken bones and internal bleeding. As it relates to body armor, blunt force trauma is caused by the force of the bullet impacting the body armor plate. This is because the kinetic energy of the bullet actually dissipates and extends beyond the body armor plate itself and the skin tissue and organs on the other side of the body armor plate are going to absorb this shockwave of energy. However, the size of that shockwave can vary based on the inertia of the bullet and the type of body armor plate being worn. The National Institute of Justice, or NIJ, has established the maximum amount of deformation allowed when it comes to body armor. This measurement is called back face signature, or commonly referred to as back face deformation. The maximum allowed back face deformation per the NIJ is 44 millimeters, or 1.73 inches. This measurement is taken by placing a block of clay behind a body armor plate and then shooting the armor plate, then measuring the depth of the resulting depression in the clay. If you're shot while wearing body armor, it's definitely good that the first bullet has been stopped effectively, but you must consider, what if there are more bullets on the way? The ability to move away from danger is an important consideration when you're looking to buy body armor. This is where you want to place some careful thought into the type of material your body armor is made of, what blunt force trauma may result, and what that means for your ability to remain mobile and rapidly egress in such a situation. When considering the right body armor for your needs, you must consider the body armor materials, but also you must consider how those materials will react should they take bullet impacts and the potential resulting blunt force trauma. As an example, the more rigid a body armor plate is, the less blunt force trauma you can expect to result from impacts. For example, if you shoot a level three steel core body armor plate with an M80 ball round, you will not see nearly as much back face deformation as you would with a level three UHM WPE body armor plate, or even a level four ceramic plate for that matter. Each material handles ballistic resistance in a different way. Steel core armor is the most rigid of the armor types that Spartan Armor Systems offers, and typically you're not gonna see much, if any, back face deformation on these plates if they should take an impact, which is significantly different compared to ceramic or UHM WPE armor composites that are going to show a large dimple on the back face of the plate should they take an impact. Do keep in mind that the kinetic energy does continue to travel beyond that dimple. The dimple effect is not seen with steel core body armor such as our Spartan Omega AR500 or Spartan AR550 products. This is because there is no armor flex in steel core armor compared to ceramic, UHM WPE, and soft armor. Bottom line, the more flexible or soft that the armor is, the more significant and the greater the potential is for blunt force trauma resulting from taking impacts on that armor. However, at Spartan Armor Systems, we do have some solutions to help mitigate and minimize the effects of such blunt force trauma. We offer trauma pads, which are made from a specially designed material to absorb a good degree of the kinetic energy that travels beyond the back of the armor plate. Trauma pads are thin and lightweight, weighing well under a pound, and an added benefit is that they also make rigid plates much more comfortable to wear due to their cushioning effect. As a quick recap, when you're shopping for body armor, the ability to move quickly away from a life-threatening situation deserves some very careful consideration. Materials used for the manufacture of body armor plates can vary widely in their flexibility and malleability. Steel core body armor is the best choice for limiting the effects of blunt force trauma. However, it is important to consider the intended application. There are some situations where ceramic or composite body armor may be much more realistic. For example, when body armor needs to be concealable, such as with our 3A flex-fused core. At this point in time, there are no perfect body armor materials on the market, so it's important to weigh all these factors before making your purchase. If you need help choosing the body armor or gear that's right for you, don't hesitate to reach out to us. Spartan Armor Systems prides itself on customer service and assisting our customers when it comes to finding optimal armor solutions that suit your needs. Visit us at SpartanArmorSystems.com and feel free to contact us with any questions.